Hey guys, I just uh, ordered a hardware wallet for my Bitcoin and it just came in the mail. It's from a company called Blockstream. It's called the Jade Plus. I'm going to open it up and let you guys see what it looks like. It came packaged really nicely in this bubble wrap style packaging. So it's nice and safe inside. I'm going to open it up now and see what it looks like. All right, just cut this open with my handy dandy razor that I always keep with me. All right, so there it is. Receipt. There's the, um, it came with this little mini uh, air, grab, air grab drive so that you don't have to have this, the actual device connected to the internet at all. You can do, do, use this for updates to the, to the firmware. And here's the box that it comes in, the Jade Plus. I'm gonna rip this open. I, I got the black version. There's a, I think there's like a silver and black version. And then I think the other one's white, but um, I'm cheap. So I bought the cheapest version. It was like, I think it was like $20 cheaper for just getting plain black. So that's, that's just how I am. <laughs> Sorry. I, the, the silver one looked kind of cool, but I'm cheap. So I had to get the simple one. The top left. All right, there's the box unwrapped. Let me open it. Oh man, it's hard to do this one. All right, so I cut that foil there and I'm gonna open it up to see what it looks like inside. And there it is. It's nice. Not too big. Has a nice screen though. Um, I'm gonna have to mess around with it first to see how it all works and I'll get back to you to see if I like it or not, but it's Definitely a good idea to get something uh, like a hardware wallet so you can hold your Bitcoin in cold storage. And uh, it's up to now, I've only had a software wallet, which is not that great because there is the slight possibility that someone could hack my phone or something and access that. But if you have it on a hardware wallet that's not connected to the internet, then people aren't able to get to it. So um, anyway... Looks kind of neat. I'm going to mess with it and then uh, get back to you to see if I like it or not.